Uh, update on the SCAR 16. Installed a Tango Down Hyperion charging handle. And that what changes your angle and the shape? Yeah, mainly the shape and the angle. So depending on what you're into, if you want it up, angled up or down, I like it down because I have all this stuff going on back here. Ace Hardware, I subbed out the uh, receiver spring or receiver bolt for a screw head. And it was a little bit extended. And I put in a, uh, I believe this was from a Mesa Tactical shotgun kit that I just took the quick detach and attached the quick detach right to my receiver. It's an M6, I forget the length. And then everybody asks who did your barrel? Oh, this was a Tornado Threading. Uh, guy's name is Mike. I think it's Mike, the Australian guy. Tornado Threading did a really good job. Uh, what he did was he opened up the gas holes a little bit and shortened the barrel. They offer a package uh, where they etch your receiver and all that for SBRing, but I was already doing that somewhere else, so they just did the barrel part. Down here, the lower, you notice on scars, um, you can only fit the BG-17, the big fat monster grip, but this is a BG-16. So what happened to happen was I actually bandsawed off about an eighth of an inch of my receiver to get this to fit. So now any AR-15 pistol grip will fit on this. Uh, Geisley trigger, super scar. And pretty much everybody who shot this has said that trigger is awesome. The uh, trigger is incredible. It feels like the S3G. Uh, one, one update I, I plan to do is uh, replace this LaRue with a, the HK height uh, mount. And that's and about that it. let you call the witness better? Uh, it's, if you see the height off the rails, it's just a little bit high on your cheap comb. So the HK height will just get it down to where you want it. Not much to do with the co-witness or anything else. It's so just, is it exchanged from like lower third to half or something? You know, uh, I think this is lower third now. That's what I mean. So if you dropped it down, it would go to half? It would go to half, but really it's this height over the bore. That's This height over bore, when you shoot uh, on an AR-15, it's usually your two and a half inch. This is closer to, it feels like four inches. Okay, so it's really to bring you back down to yeah, a more comfortable Yeah, so when you're shooting holdover. up close... It screws up your compensation, so you really need to bring this down so you're more like you're shooting an AR. Yeah, wasn't it Steve who was saying he uses the HK? It's just the same holdover yeah, as Steve, his AR. Steve has okay. an HK on his. Steve from Magpul. Mm -hmm. Right on. Well, thanks for the update. The guys and gals of GunWebsites.com encourage you to take a CCW class every year, practice at least once a month, and carry every day. Thanks for watching GunWebsites.com.